Hey guys, so today is like my last day in Greece. Tomorrow I leave back to, first I fly to Italy to Milano Bergamo airport and then I take a shared van to Slovenia. So I'll arrive late at night back to Slovenia and I'll start here like from midday going toward the airport. So. Today will be the last video of the Greek series. I already returned my scooter to, to where I rented it, so I'm basically stuck in the hotel. I will go later to the pool. I already went once today, but now it's very hot outside because it's like 3, 3 o'clock p.m. So I'll wait until 6 when the sun is not as strong. Look, that's the, re the result of me being in the sun. As you can see, I'm very brown and I lost like half a skin. <laughs> but yeah, don't worry, it will heal in maybe a week. It, I will be okay and brown again. So, what we will do today, we'll try a new drink today. Um, while I still had a scooter, I went there to buy some sandwiches for tomorrow. Because I will be on the road all day and I don't want to spend a lot of money. So, when you fly, always be prepared to have your food with you from the local store, don't buy it in the airports, you, they will overcharge you like three, four times, so travel tip number one. Anyway, I was in this little shop, which is like German, I think, but okay, they have like lower prices in Europe, so it's like a low cost shop. And I found one uh, interesting drink there, of course, I look for interesting drinks. And yeah, today we will try this interesting drink, I will show you in a minute. No, before a minute, just now. <laughs> Stay tuned. Uh -oh. Big Joe! Cheap travels. Travel on a budget. Here we are with my mystery drink. It's like a Brazilian cocktail. It says type, type Capirinha. Capirinha, if you don't know, it's a kind of Brazilian cocktail. It's, it's made out of sugarcane spirit and lemonade. Do they put lemonade inside? No, I'm not sure. It's been like 10 years since I've been to Brazil and that was the last time that I had it. But remember, I remember I liked it. <laughs> it was very good. So we have this monkey head. I guess that's the name of this co of this company. And what does it say? Stay cool. Go ahead. Enjoy your monkey head. Yay! Monkey head, monkey head, monkey, monkey, monkey. So, yeah, we'll be trying this. And I think it has like, yeah, it's two deciliters, 6.9% volume, which is quite good for a canned uh, cocktail. It's a little bit small. Look, this is my hand. <laughs> so it's very small. Only two deciliters, but okay. I took it just to try it. And... Uh, the price was 0 0.79 cents, so about 80 euro cents for this, which is quite a lot, but okay. I also brought bought some salty sticks, uh, not to be hungry today, and I bought some Shiraz, Australian wine. Uh, yeah, that one set me back like uh, 2 euro 60, I think. So compare this to euro 60. For the whole bottle, which is about 13.5%. Uh, so this one, yeah, this one's not very economical, but yeah. It's something I haven't tried before, that's why I bought it, because I want to try it. I like trying new things out, so we will be trying the Capirina, Capirinha Cocktail Monkey Head in Greece, Corfu Island, uh, Cavos City. So yeah, let me open this baby up and let's see what it tastes like. What do you think, guys? Let's go! Sorry guys, it's so hard to set up the camera here because of this light in my room. The lightning is terrible. 
but okay. Here is the monkey head guy. Let's open him up. Green eyes, green eyes. Let's open his, him up and see see how he tastes like. Capirinha, capirinha. A little bit of smoke coming out. Let's try it. Strange smell. It really smells like some herb. The smell would be a one out of ten. <laughs> My god, it smells awful. It smells nothing like caprina. Very sour. Slightly carbonated. <coughs> Tastes nothing like caprinha. No. A little bit of honey with men, mint or something like that. Kind of sourishly sweet, more sour than sweet. Though I like it. Thumbs down, Joe does not approve. So if we thought I was making a commercial for this drink, guess again. <laughs> I don't like it. I'm sorry I paid 80 cents for it, it's not worth it. <laughs> It smells terrible, like some, like meat, mint, you know, or menta, menthol, I don't know what. The mint tea, like the mint tea, smell a little like the mint tea. Of course, I will not let it go to waste, I paid 80 cents for it, so I have to drink it. But this monkey head, never again, <laughs> never again. 2 out of 10, because it still has 7% alcohol, that's why I give it 1 point for the taste. No. The looks, it looks okay, but the taste and the smell. So no, no guys, no, 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 no. I cannot recommend this, so I wouldn't buy it again, that's all I can say. Now I'm happy it's not half a liter, it's only two deciliters, you know. Tastes nothing like Caperinha. Nothing. I'll be struggling with this today. <laughs> Let me see where it's made. Uh, it says Germany. We're packed, packaged by a package by Germany. Okay. Uh, it has sulfate, and it doesn't say anything else. So no idea. Only that it's packed in Germany. Packaged by this and this. Uh, Peter Mer Meritz KG. Wein Kelleri Brauereis Deutschland Berden Castle Quez Alemania Germany and it, it contains so, sulfates and what else it contains it has nothing else written on it so God knows what's inside I don't know if this is even allowed to do in European Union. What they did here you don't know anything what's inside no count of calories no count of sugars no count of anything 
This should be banned by a fine or something. Ooh. Don't want to spill it anyway. <laughs> I paid it for it, I drink it. Don't bite. It's like mint tea, a little bit carbonated. You can feel the alcohol, but it's no way a capirinha. Not a K, C, not a C from Capirinha. So yeah, I just wanted to share a new thing I try here. So this was my last Greek video. It wasn't very Greek, but <laughs> what can I do? You want me to show you the pool again? <laughs> That's the only thing I can record here. So I decided to do, to do a small test of this drink that I bought today. Uh, did I make a mistake? Yes, it was a mistake. Would I buy it again? No, I would not buy it again, sir. I still have one bottle of wine to finish. I, I tried that wine, so I know it's okay. Uh, it's one of my favorites, the Shiraz, uh, Shiraz Cabernet. Cabernet Shiraz from Australia. It's always good. Mm. <laughs> it's a bit heavy wine, but, but I like it. So yeah, anyways guys, I would like you to thank you for watching my videos and tomorrow I'll make another video of me leaving Greece for Milan and then to Slovenia. <sighs> it's been an okay holiday I think. Could I stay more? Maybe. But it's okay, it's getting very hot now, you know, so. Time to go back home and see you on my next adventures where they will be where? Uh, 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 uh. Uh, okay, let me give you a hint. It will not be in Europe, it will be on another continent. And yeah, until then, see you guys. I'm burping from this drink. Uh, see you guys. And yeah, be sure to like the video, share with your friends, family, I don't know, lovers, uh, <laughs> boyfriends, girlfriends, <laughs> whoever, you know, grandmother, grandfather. <laughs> and yeah, if you are not subscribed, I would appreciate if you do so, you would have my channel. And yeah, see you in my next video. Which I don't know which will be what will be like because the new series will not come out out until end of September, I think. So I don't know what I will record in between. Uh, but yeah, I'll try to. I don't know if I will. I will keep uh, one video per day after this Greek series. Because, because <laughs> where I go, it will not be permitted to to have videos from there because of security reasons. So only after I leave the country, I will uh, start posting videos. That's why. So yeah, now I got you intrigued. Huh? <laughs> Stay tuned, follow my channel, and you will learn everything about it. And yeah. See you in my next video. Anyways, take care guys, always. Take care. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you subscribe to my channel, put a like there and see you next time.